Rei Yoko Yamada, a high school boy whose father works for Tojo Film Productions, is inspired to create his own short film with his friends. One day, while out scavenging actors for his film, he spots a poster of Papako, an adult video actress who's well endowed, stating she lives in the area. So, she is a gagan, or giant, in her field. Ray is a high schooler who has two passions, film directing and an adult movie star, Papako. He catches rumor of signs around his area, and when he investigates it, the sign says his favorite actress actually lives in the neighborhood. He takes it on himself to take them all down, but before he finishes, the very same actress sees him taking the last one down and hugs him in gratitude. After chatting with her, Ray finds out that she's actually a nice person. Her real name is Chiho, and she seems quite different from the raunchy films that make her out to be. Chiho does live close by with her abusive boyfriend and manager. When Chiyo witnesses an accident on the street, she goes to help the man by calling an ambulance. Before she can, he slaps a strange device on her arm and dies, then turns into a doll. She finds a DVD on the ground and, after watching it, finds out that the dead guy is some sort of alien tourist. While in the bathroom, she turns the disc on her arm and, after ripping out of her clothes, she grows to take on the whole space in the room. Luckily, she can just dial the device back to change back to normal size. When Ray comes to her apartment to watch the DVD, her boyfriend freaks out and starts to beat on Ray. Chiho uses the device and takes care of her former boyfriend in her huge size. This is all happening with a backdrop of a website that lets people vote on events that actually turn out to be true. They vote to have excrement fall from the sky and everything falls to cover the city in crap. Vote to have a celebrity run naked in the street, and he does. UFO? Dragons? Sure. The events seem to get crazier and crazier until it looks like they're about to affect many people's lives in the city. There are so many stories going on at the same time, but Gigant seems to blend them well. We have Ray's story with him trying to find people to act and make his film. We have Chiho and her ability to grow. We have the ETE, Enjoy the End, website causing havoc in the, throughout the city. Gagant seems to meld all these stories together, so it does not seem like three plus separate stories. Yes, Gagant is a very adult type manga. Since she works in the industry, we see lots of nudity even in her giant form. What should impress you most, other than the story, is the details put into every panel. From detailed rumpled sheets to all the little signs in the stores in the background. Background people have actual faces rather than just blanks that a lot of other mangas have for far off people. As of October 2020, there are two volumes in hard copy with the third due in November and number four in January 2021. With the effort needed to translate and redraw needed to get these out in the Americas, these releases are rather quick, three in four months. Gagant may have a high school as part of its story, but it's definitely would not call it a school life manga. It is very much an adult, etchy, romance, supernatural type thing. Come for the etchy, stay for the end of the world, and the giant naked girl too. That's all for the manga Gagant, and if you want to find about other lesser known manga series, just take a look at the other stuff in my feed. Hit that like button and drop a comment down below. Till next time, bye. Thanks for watching. There is a lot more to about some very adult type manga. Look in the appropriate playlist and go have some fun.